So if you're like me and tired of typing the same email over and over again, I found a super simple way to create templates directly inside of Gmail. But first, you need to enable this feature within the settings. And I'll show you how to do that right now. So you want to start by logging into your Gmail account where you want to send the templates from. And once you're inside there, you want to click the gear icon to get into your settings and you want to see all settings. And then you want to click on advanced. Now within advanced, there's several different options here, but the one that we're looking for is templates. And we want to make sure that that is enabled. And here's the key. You want to make sure that you save that before uh, you exit out of that. So you want to save those changes. Now, once that's enabled, you can create your first template. And the way you do this is you want to just click compose, just like you would a regular email and type the response that you want. Now, this could be a case for business where you want to have a, a standard reply to inquiries or uh, if, if you're sending a lot of emails, even in your personal life, if you just have a bulk email that you want to send to friends for uh, to share a video or to share something or, or update them with a, a life event and you don't want to you know, have everybody copied on the same, same email, you can create these templates for that. So whatever the function is, you just start by writing up the email. So I just typed up a simple email here. Thank you for your inquiry. I'll get an answer to you and reply shortly, okay? All right, once you have the email prepared, then you wanna go down to the bottom. Instead of going to send, you wanna go to these three dots. And once you have the template feature enabled, you'll see the template option here. So when you hover over that, you'll see an option to save draft as template. And what we want to do is we want to save as a new template. And then uh, it's going to ask you to save the name. And what I found is this default is just pulling from the subject line of your email. And that to me seems like the best way to kind of keep everything organized so that you know which template that you're sending when. Uh, but you can make this whatever you want. You click save. And that's all you have to do to create the template. Now that you've created that template, to use that, all you have to do is go up to Compose like you would normally. And again, go down to these three dots here and go to Templates. And you'll see right within that list are the template we just created. So you click on that and boom. Now all you need to do is add your contact, who you're sending the email to. You can modify or tweak that email if you need to uh, that won't affect your template. So you could change this to be reply by tomorrow specifically for this recipient but that won't affect the template. And then you add who you want to send that to and send. And that's as easy as it gets. And I hope you found this tutorial helpful and thank you so much for watching.